Hey guys, Shane here, and today I'm back with another Loot Crate Unbox. This month is March's... Uh, I actually don't know what the theme of this month is, so uh, let's open it up and check it out. I'm gonna open it up and I'll let you guys see first as usual, so... Anything good? Let's check it out. So, let's see, let me, let me pull out the book and see at least what the theme is for this month. So... This month's theme is Versus. So this is the March 2016 uh, box, uh, the theme of Versus. And I'm just gonna start going through it. So first thing I see on top, guys, is a shirt. So again, every Loot Crate this year is supposed to have a shirt in it. And I've been pretty happy with the shirt so far. I think I've worn most of them. This one looks like to be a throwback. So if you're a fan of Star Trek, uh, you guys would recognize this as one of the old school Star Trek shows. Um, but it's a pretty neat shirt. I'm not much of a fan of the color really, but whatever, I'll rock it. Sweet. And this is a large size, so yeah, so that's why I get mine, so it should fit just fine. Uh, one thing I do like about the Loot Crate shirts is they seem to all fit pretty, pretty good. I haven't had one yet that didn't fit really good on me, like just how it looks. Matter of fact, this one right here is actually a Loot Crate shirt. I got a while back. This is a Power Rangers shirt. Um, next I see a beanie, so this looks like a cool beanie, it's got a, looks like the Daredevil logo right here, and uh, it says a sticker says reversible, pull the sticker off, not gonna need that, uh, but let's reverse it and see what it looks like. Ooh, I like the color, it's a nice gray and black color, and it says a Punisher logo on this side, so that's pretty sweet, so yeah, that's a pretty sweet beanie. It's getting hot outside, so I'm not sure I'll wear it, really. Uh, maybe I can make like a parody video. I've been wanting to do like a parody video, uh, doing a bunch of different things, like tastings like I usually do, but with uh, like a parody like, pretending I'm like other YouTubers. So maybe it'll be like an H3, H3 on this one, but cool. Next, we have Alien vs. Predator figure. So it could either be Alien or Predator, I'm not sure. Let's open it up and check it out. I'm, uh, I like the figures they give me. It's a mystery one again, so let's see which one it is. This is... The Alien! Sweet! So, cool little alien figure. This will probably go to my desk, of course. See, it's pretty neat, pretty detailed. It's, uh, it's really basic, uh, but it's a nice little figure. Uh, it's pretty cool. Yeah. And then, of course, we have this month's pin, which looks to be uh, Alien vs. Predator. Uh, it's got some color to it. Nice little pin there. Well, again, I like the pins they started to give out this year. They're a lot more uh, colorful. They're kind of like Disney pins if you go into Disney for. It's a card. Uh, it's an advertisement for uh, World Gush, it says. A party game about everything you love. So it's an app. It's a download for a free app on the App Store for this game called World Gush. Um, Loot Crate subscribers can unlock free exclusive bonus categories. So maybe I'll check it out. Maybe not. I don't really play too many games on my phone. But I'll check it out. Next, uh, looks like it'd be a Superman versus Batman item. So this is kind of cool. It's a uh, Superman on that side, a Batman on that side, Superman versus Batman logos. Oh, it's some kind of a wallet. It's made out of paper. So it's like a, it's got some like things in here just to kind of show you where you would put cards or money. Um, Mighty Wallet by Dino Mighty Design. It's recyclable. I guess I'll try it out. I mean, I don't. I can. It doesn't. It's pretty heavy duty paper, but not sure how good it'll work. It's a paper wallet, but it's definitely pretty neat. I like it. So cool. If you guys have any of these, put some comments down below. Let me know how they work. I'll check it out. Uh, looks like the last item besides the book is a Loot Crate exclusive uh, Harley Quinn number one comic. So this is actually pretty sweet. I'm excited for the Suicide Squad that's coming out soon. Uh, so I'll probably read this. I'm gonna get back uh, reading some of the old Suicide Squad comics and stuff as well Just to kind of get some backstory and stuff and be more familiar for when the movie comes out uh, But I'm pretty excited about that. So I'll read this definitely it looks pretty cool sweet art on the front there uh, Yeah, sweet And then of course the usual book kind of tells you about what's in the loot crate um, What was in the mega crate that I didn't get again? Um, just some different things about the different items in the in the crate and uh there's a about the shirt, the Star Trek shirt. Um, yeah, they're usually pretty neat, some pretty neat stuff, especially if you don't know what some of the items are from in here, then it's usually pretty cool to read this. 
And uh, that's about it. Again, the box will fold out uh, to some kind of a scene. Uh, this looks to be like a jungle scene for the alien versus predator. Um, if you fold it out, it's kind of like a display box. You put your little figure on that, uh, this little alien figure so you can kind of display it. But yeah, that's it guys. Uh, that's it for this month's March box. Um, if you uh, liked any of these things, uh, put some comments down below. Let me know what you thought. Uh, as usual, like and subscribe. I do look great unboxings. I'm gonna, to, I'm gonna start doing some more reviews of things like my new S7 phone and things like that. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna continue to do my food tastings. I have some more coming up like uh, Japanese Kit Kats and uh, Australian candies and such like that. Um, also, uh, if you want to get your own Loot Crate, I'll put a link down below. You guys can get a discounted price on the Loot Crate. Um, or if not, you can always come back and just watch my videos as I unbox them as well. That's cool too. Um, but yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you like any of these things or have some comments about them, please. I love responding to you guys and interacting with all you guys in the comments. Um, it's one of my favorite things to do. I love when people comment on my videos and I can just kind of interact with the viewers. Um, yeah, so as always, guys, like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, and until next time.